Hey YouTube. Hopefully you can hear me over the sound of my servers. Hopefully you all can forgive me for lacking on videos once again. I've been going through some old footage on my storage server only to realize that a lot of the videos that I've wanted to do for you all things like how to refurbish a classic Xbox to uh, my tie rod ends for the Pontiac to a lot of stuff, even the building of a new PFSense server which I wound up giving to my brother um, all that video footage is corrupted I was trying to find what I was doing in the beginning was recording as much as I could, as quick as I could so that I could make sure that y'all had plenty of videos to see at least once a week it's gotten to the point that I'm currently now going through my server moving files off into a separate hard drive that are corrupted to find, see if there's some way to repair them the data should still be there it's showing the proper amount of size for the files on the quality and everything the data should be there it's just corrupted I have no idea how to recover it I have no idea how to repair it once I figure that out I can once again use that footage to make you all more videos um, I, and a lot of it was computer videos older hardware things that I want to show you can still have a useful purpose in everyday life unfortunately because of such video corruption I have been stalled I have lost well had lost a lot of my spark to try and continue making videos it is nothing against you all it is all on me I should have realized that when my GoPro camera which I originally did all the video footage on started getting that hot it was causing corruption um, mainly because my brother's camera that he used to use for Christmas video recordings does the same thing. Takes pictures absolutely fine. A minute or two clip absolutely fine. But once his camera is taking too long of a video, it starts heating up really bad and it's already killed a couple of his memory cards. Um, so that's what happened to the SanDisk. Unfortunately, SanDisk was not able to recover my data off of that one chip that you all saw me talk about in a previous video I applaud them for trying, I thank them for trying and I thank them for making such quality products in fact right now the camera I'm using which is new and has been fully tested is recording at 1080p it is another SanDisk 32 gigabyte memory card and it's capable of recording up to about 4-ish to 5 hours worth of recording time on it as a result, I hope to start bringing you all more video, as well as, well, updating once a week properly again. I am currently trying to save money to buy parts for and make two, three more servers out of older hardware, like Pentium 4s and stuff, things like that. But unfortunately, I gotta wait till I can save up more money. So, I hope you all continue watching. I hope you all at least try to enjoy what I can put out. Uh, I hope you all have a good day, night, whatever. Please subscribe. I now have my... I now have a Twitter. As well as I'm working on a Facebook group. I will post links in the description on where you can... like, subscribe, or whatever to said... Uh, websites. Um, I will make sure to post upcoming video footage, not footage, but screenshots and stuff of said footage onto Twitter so y'all can see what's coming up. Um, the Facebook group is just, I'm planning it to be an archive, but also a interactive platform in order to talk to my 15 subscribers. Um, yeah, if y'all have any ideas, and I'm also thinking about making a Patreon. But I'm going to hold off on that until I have 100 subscribers. If I ever get that many. One thing I do know is I do love making these videos and I do love trying to explain what I do. Unfortunately, I also did notice as I was going through other videos that my the way my mind supposedly works from what people have told me is I can make connections that others just can't see. And as I was going through those videos, I realized I was doing that anyways, and not explaining the steps I was using to get to set conclusions. 
Uh, from now on, I'm going to do my best to try and explain everything in the best but least amount of detail if that makes sense. So say the camera I'm using records at 1080p. It is a DV power. has a about a half hour battery on it. But it's a really good camera. It works as it's designed. It's a action camera. The GoPro, I'm pretty sure, died because I originally was using it to record the solar eclipse that happened last year. And I had it pointed at sun for a couple hours, direct sunlight. I'm pretty sure what caused the damage was somewhere in there, something most likely melted a little. So as it power, has power going through it, making said recordings, it is overheating where it's melted, causing it to heat up further and further and further until it gets so hot it causes the video corruption. Heat kills components. I mean, it, that's why we do our best to keep our components as cool as we can. Um, it's why a lot of extreme overclockers water cool or even use liquid nitrogen because if they do not, they will kill their components. So therefore, heat is what most likely killed the GoPro. And that is an example of me trying to explain things better because I had a point at the sun. The sun, the heat from the sun was permanently hitting into that lens, most likely melted said lens somewhere, uh, thereby causing it to damage said lens. So now anytime I record for a certain amount of time, it heats up that said component, causing more and more heat to accumulate, causing it to start corrupting the video because it's starting to overheat the, overheat the micro SD card. If that was an easy explanation, I hope it was, uh, then that's good. If not, post a comment in the description on better ways I can try to explain what I do. Um, but back to what I was saying on the outro, which I just realized I went off on a tangent. I apologize for that. Um, I now have a Twitter. That is now in the going to be in the description. I have a Facebook group. I am working on my own website. All links are in the description to said things. Uh, follow me on Twitter. Follow me on here on YouTube. Subscribe. Press like if you like my videos. Press dislike. Share the channel. Try to help me out, people, because I'm doing the best I can with very limited resources. I know I complain about money a lot, but I'm actually starting to enjoy the challenge of what I can do with very little money. I will see y'all next time.